Okay, so here we are on this lawn which we have scarified today. Uh, obviously using the scarifying uh, machine there. Um, we have our billy goat vacuum to take some of this up, getting it all in nice lines so that we can vacuum it up and then put it in a, in a big sack. But in the meantime, here we go. This is what we do, doing it old school. Matthew going through, raking up all the rubbish for us, get it in nice piles, and then either we'll be sucking it up with the vacuum or we'll be picking it up by hand and putting it into bags. But this is what a fresh scarified lawn looks like. Later. And what we're seeing now on this lawn is Matthew doing a little bit of fine tuning with a lawnmower. So it's been scarified, it's been raked, it's been sucked up by the billy goat vacuum. What we're doing now, just cutting off the tines and the um, uh, loose bits of grass that have been pulled up by the scarifier so that uh, we can give a nice finish on it. That plus a uh, good nitrogen feed, we should see this um, lawn recovering uh, very quickly and looking good within uh, a few weeks. A few moments later. Hi, right, here we are. We are looking at our aerator. Um, again, Billy Goats uh, manufacture Honda engine. And what we're gonna be doing here is some solid tine. So that's your solid, there's your tines and there they are, big dagger-like things. They will be going into the soil so that we can get some moisture going down into the soil to uh, help uh, its improvement there. So, uh, how's this work? Turn it on. Drop her down. And she will bite, she will kick, she will fight. So you need to give this machine a lot of respect. The uh, handle here will uh, stop as soon as you let go. So there's no need to be going through greenhouses, sheds, fences, or knocking into pots or trees. So here we go, and we're off. Pull her up. Give her a spin round. Drop her down. There we go, aeration uh, in progress.